people used to think of Canada as the breadbasket of the world because it produced so much wheat, especially here in Saskatchewan. Times have changed. Now they could say that we're the pantry of the world, producing millions of tons of pulses from red lentils to chickpeas to navy beans. We're even number one exporter of dried peas in the world. Reg Roth is one of those farmers who 25 years ago left the world of wheat in favor of pulses. We are on your land, a land that you and your family are harvesting from generation to generation. You still have the same happiness when you look at all the things that you've created with your family. Yeah, I enjoy farming. Yeah. It's become a way of life. It's actually relaxing. And that's what you like. You look at your fields and it makes you happy to see what you've done. It gives you pride to have a nice crop. Yeah. I like watching things grow. I like taking them off and seeing a nice yield. You start the year by getting your equipment ready for seeding. Yeah. And we use air seeders now. So you go out, you seed your crop. Then uh, harvest time, this time of year, we'll go out, we'll desiccate and straight cut this crop. Canadian dried peas are mostly sold to India, Bangladesh and China, with Chinese market getting bigger and bigger. They turn peas into pea protein powder, pea fiber and starch. These ingredients are added to baking mix, soup mix, vermicelli and sauces. We're a long way from grandma's pea soup. 25 years ago, you were among the first farmers to say, hey, wheat is good, but why not try something else? Yes, I was. <laughs> uh, land's good here. I wanted to produce something that was maybe more profitable. Yeah. And it's good for the land. How come? It uh, adds nitrogen, so you don't need to push nitrogen in with it. So it fixes its own. So it, uh, it allows you to basically have a summer follow crop and get paid for it. Wow, it gives a break to this. It gives it a break to the soil. To the soil. All, all crops following peas grow well. Oh yeah? Oh yeah. I love walking into a field that I know I planted. Yeah. I put my work into it and see a good harvest. So do you think there's a bright future for pulses in Canada? Oh yeah, it'll always be here. It'll never, never go away now. Canada exports over 3 million tons of dried peas every year. That's enough peas to fill 2 billion bags as you would buy in a supermarket. This is why we are the best.